I thought I had some winners for you. I thought I thought I could have been somebody. I thought I could have been a contender. I actually would like to occasionally bring good news to the uh, auditing community. I know I just slam on you left and right. And I, I don't always want to. I'm not saying that there is a... I'm not saying that it is lawful or that it is criminally, you're criminally culpable if you're hosting a live stream and somebody posts harassing or retaliatory messages against a public official in Texas. I am not saying that. Uh, Mr. Hemming was going to, or at least he said he was going to, get me some information on Texas state law while he was down there in Texas. I, I guess he got so excited about, I don't know, bringing Padilla into the fold and calling Mr. Warden a sex predator that he forgot all about the, uh, the law. And that's fine. I don't expect everybody to have my personal priorities of trying to figure out where everybody stands in this whole game. But I thought I had a winner. Uh, the Jones v. Dirty World. Oh, these are good cases. These are really good cases. There's two of them. Uh, this one is uh, 766 FSUP 2nd 828. This one is 755 F3rd 398. Great cases. Great cases. Dovey, the city of New York. It was a, wasn't the best one, but it was a thing. And then the uh, Armani Medical Center, Alvia Armani Medical Center. That was a good one. <clears throat> and then I realized while I'm reading these things that there's a problem. This is a civil case. CV, civil case. This one's also a civil case. Doesn't say it anywhere. But it is. You've got a plaintiff. Versus a defendant, plaintiff, it's a civil case. This one is also a plaintiff versus a defendant. The problem is, it's all civil. So I went back to the statute and I started looking. And, and the problem is the way it has appeared apparently been defined is that no effect on criminal law. They take that to mean no effect on criminal law as in no effect on criminal law. State law, nothing will be construed to prevent any state from enforcing the state law that is consistent with this section, which means no effect on criminal law. So this is not the smoking gun. I thought I had it. I thought I had a winner for you, but this this isn't it. Now, could an attorney make an argument on this one? Well, first of all, an attorney would look for a better a better defense than this. That's where an attorney would start, presuming without evidence that there is no better defense than this. Then would an attorney make an argument on this that it should apply? Yeah. Yeah, I could make an argument it should apply. Would that argument stick? <laughs> I, I don't think so. And uh, let's see, where was it? It is the Communications Decency Act. Uh, uh, uh. The purpose of the CDA is to establish federal immunity to any cause of action. Cause of action, civil action. 
that would make service providers liable for information originating with a third party user of this service. Civil action. It is not a criminal charge. Telecommunications Act, Communication Decency Act. Does it say it in here? Does it not say it in here? Congress intended the statute to confer immunity on service providers that act as publishers and host third-party content while maintaining the ability to ensure vigorous enforcement of federal criminal laws to deter stuff. Thus, it does not compel blah, blah, blah. Yeah, so it's... Uh, so 47 U.S.C. 230 is not going to provide the auditor's protection. Am I saying that they don't have protection? I am absolutely not saying that. Am I saying that the prosecution has a slam dunk case against them? No. I am still of the belief that they couldn't or shouldn't be held liable for the actions unless they're actively encouraging it. If someone just posts something on their on their chat and they're unaware of it and or not, not encouraging it, then they should not be held liable, criminally liable. Now, again, caveats is I don't know exactly what law in Texas would allow for that. So that's caveat number one. Caveat number two is I don't know the exact evidence that the prosecution would be relying on or that the magistrate was relying on. So I am still shooting in the dark. So once again, I'm saying I don't know, but this one isn't it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.